Local government begins payment of bus refunds to indigent students. Is it not good for governments to be sensitive to the plight of the masses when the times are hard? Times are very hard now, but the Olusha Gwonirude led administration in Badagri local government is making efforts to provide succor for indigent students from its communities. So I will introduce the executive chairman, Badagri local government, and the president of Honorable Gwonirude Olusha Seated at the right hand is the supervisor for education and library services. Indigent students from Badagri Town, Ajido, Ajara, Ikoga, Dalewidako, Yafi, Topo, Agelasho, and many more who are in Nigeria tertiary institutions have started receiving payment alert from the Finance Department of Badagri Local Government under the Onilude Bursary Award. Like I always say in, in absentia, that the chairman loves you guys and you want the best for you, especially at this crucial time. Speaking at the check presentation held inside the office of the chairman and anchored by the chief of staff to the chairman, Dr. Sewedo Samuel, the council boss, Olushegu Onilude, says the bursary was part of his administration's promise to the youth and students while seeking their vote for a second term in office. Onilude also noted that all of his own generation never had privilege of receiving bursary award while in school. For beneficiaries who submitted account details of personal e-wallets like OPAY, the executive chairman advises them to contact the education department and replace such e-wallets with details with regular bank accounts. We've gotten your account number. And my city council treasurer has assured me that by tomorrow everything will be done. But he said some people sent okay, the number can be transferred, but it has to be your own account name. Is that clear? Okay. Speaking to the voice on the sidelines of the event, the Supervisor for Education, Honorable Sewede Port Balogun Olorun Femi, says a total of 184 indigent students have been shortlisted to benefit from the scheme. Take a listen. Mrs. Sewede Port Balogun Olorun Femi, the Supervisor for Education, a lot is going on today. I would say just about the, the bus It's about coming together of the executive chairman, the students, the supervisor, and some of the staffs of the local government. So today is the D-Day. Like it started very well. And today is the presentation. And uh, today, our indigents in Badagri local government, all the successfully screened indigents in Badagri local government, will be getting their cash today on transfer. Some of them are already getting. Actually, we we have 184. Like that was what the screening committee submitted to the local government. As you all know, it was free and fair. So we need to wait for the screening committee, and they gave us the total number of 184. But with our discretion, I think we are still going to 200. And by the grace of God, we'll get there. We're already working on some other ones. But as of today and tomorrow, 184 will be getting it. Okay, as we all know, the executive chairman is an educationist, like I always say, an educationist by excellence. He came up with an idea saying the school fees is not the same. So we have medical students and we all know that medical is very, as in very, very expensive. Then the engineers too. And we have some law students. We understand the situation those ones are facing that is different from the general courses. How much? So they are getting 50,000 naira for the special courses like the medicine I said now, uh, the law students and the engineers. Other courses are getting 20,000 naira 
it directly will affect the parents at this crucial time. So whatever we are giving them now, I think so many, so many parents are aware. And we know that this will go a long way by helping the parents in terms of paying their school fees or other expenses. It is not enough to pay their school fees, we all know that. But at least it will go a long way in helping them, at least assisting them to meet up with some crucial financial needs. The beneficiaries also took turn to speak with the Voice Global before leaving the event. Take a listen. I'm Ajakwe Abusama, a student of Lagos State University, a 400 level student of Faculty of Law, and I'm an indigent of Badagi Local Government, the, the beneficiary of the Badagi Local Government of Austria. It is a thing of joy because to those of us who has been on the on the race for the chairman to give us a bursary and it's coming to coming alive in our presence is a thing of joy and we are eternally grateful to the chairman and especially grateful to the supervisor of education who made this happen under our administration. As a law student I receive the token of 50,000 naira. I think I'm at liberty not to, to do whatever I want to do with it, sir. And to the best of my knowledge, I will make sure I spend it viciously and reasonably. My name is Eumi Dokaz Chijo. I'm a student of Lagos State University from the Faculty of Education, a 300 level student. Yes, this was me. I can see it that is very, very useful to me. Yeah, I think they should have done it because presently now I'm moving to the next level and actually we paid our previous fee. Um, but this one, I believe we're still going to add it to the current one that we are going to pay. Actually, I'll spend that for Peter already, but the many one, I'll still use it meaningfully. Um, my name is William Minasu Joseph Bulu Atife. I'm a student of Lagos State University, Faculty of Basic Clinical Sciences. Um, from the Department of Pharmacology. I'm a 400 level student. So, um, and also one of the beneficiaries of this poster. Um, a sum of 50,000 Naira. This morning is actually coming in at the right time because currently now I have a um, presentation to do in school and then I have exhibition to do. So I feel that I will actually use the money judiciously to actually settle and to actually um, carry out my exhibition. My message to the chairman is that I would like to appreciate him for this wonderful opportunity given unto us and also for, um, for this aid that is rendering to us um, to actually ac achieve academic success. So, Temitayo Ogunleye, narrating for The Voice Global, as reported by the editor-in-chief, Ovi Manuel Kukonu. 